Today we're checking out Seal Fledge. I imagine I'm horribly pronouncing it. Uh, it is a foreign game. Uh, but the reason why I want to check this one out is, as some of you might know, I'm lucky enough to have my beautiful baby shark, uh, my daughter, the joy of my life. And so this actually is a game about raising a daughter. So when I saw this, I was actually very interested uh, to see how it worked out. So let's give it a try. It's anticlimactic. English, normal. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, I love that. Anytime a game adds in a colorblind feature, that's very nice. Uh, as some people might know, I'm red, green deficient colorblind, so that little add-on is very nice. We're jetsoning this? Hey, right, if we're jetsoning it, we're jetsoning it. Jane, get me off this terrible thing. Does that work for this? Or is that more of a Scooby Doo? Okay. I see what you did there. Look, I don't know why they're living above the earth, though. That earth looks beautiful. Okay. Alien creature called the Gigant. So why are we safe on in the sky, then, if it was an alien? And don't those come from the sky? Space. So wait, the aliens are attacking again. That's what that means, right? Because the recent destruction of the Ark Five marks the recognition of the conflict over a stalemate of hundred years. So, so space didn't really solve it, did it? So I thought this game was a daughter raising simulator, but there are aliens in it, and I am already feeling a bit lost. Okay. This game kind of weird. So far, all I can say about this game is slow intro. So that's apparently the girl I'm guessing a simulation raise. Uh, 
Is that supposed to be me? Is that the alien? Or are those the humans? So much description not needed, but so little that is. Roll credits. game requires a lot of patience. I mean, I know I could just skip giant chunks here with that W key just staring me in the face for skip, but yeah, then, you know, I wouldn't know all this amazing exposition. Oh my god. That better not be slowly making its way down the bottom of the screen. There's not even music anymore. Did the game expect me to skip these and they're just punishing me for being a jerk? Well, that just looks like an apartment, like in a skyscraper. One hour later. I really want this game to be good, though. So I'm looking at this out the window of the balcony, and all I can think is hazard. But this is not a baby. This is like a... This is like a just a lot of loud knocking. We got the music back, that's good. Couldn't do an animation for a door opening. Okay. Yeah, that works. They don't use the... Okay, so I guess I can... No. So I'm using... I'm using the keyboard to select words on the digital keyword. Keyboard. <sighs> No, I'm not nerdy pan. I accept that. Oh. Okay. Exploration? Am I raising a daughter or... <laughs> Those fucking lips. Options? Oh, nurse, I guess. Great 
profession. I, nothing was known about the circumstances of your birth. I think I just answered that with the vat grown baby. A secret and abandoned project? Sure. <laughs> if it's a little known about my past and it's like kind of hinted at that I'm background, then why? Well, first of all, why did I tell this lady that I don't know? It's like, why are we sharing that now? Yeah, I read it in the 30 minute long intro. Arc 3. So is the that we're gonna help them none? Cause that would be hilarious. Ain't that just like the government? Ask the regular people that pay taxes to foot the bill. Special circumstances. <laughs> Cat got your tongue? What? I'm not the one not talking. Oh. That is not the same kid from the prior scene. Uh, yeah, because she's clearly an alien. I mean, no regular mouth makes that gesture. See, Beacon Alien. Because she's an alien. Because she's an alien. Because she's an alien! Because she's an alien. Not if you realize she's an alien! Did you, lady, did you not watch the 30 minute long intro you expected me to skip? Because she's an alien. Don't you talk back to me in front of my future daughter. <laughs> oh, are they going to let me choose it? This part always makes me laugh in games. Nope. Nope. That is not your name. I'm going to really show my maturity here. father ever <laughs> the game should turn and be all like we're gonna find another home <laughs> this makes up for the entire intro taking so long <laughs> it's with a name like fart pants I'm sure she'll get along great with me That's, no, that's outside, lady. I don't know where, yeah, miracle or not, she just walked into my living room and sort of go outside. Yeah, apparently she left, like, common courtesy as well. To, to live with a man that forces her to be called fart? Sure. <sighs> Uh, that's Mr. Pants to you, lady. Uh, 
Uh, it's not really that weird. I mean, clearly I'm an amazing father. I mean, it feels sudden. She was just rescued. It's not like she stayed in a holding bay. And it's like, okay, we need you to take her now. Like, that would be sudden out of nowhere. This is, we found a kid. We need someone to take care of a kid. Is there no child protective services on this space station or pla- uh, like air place? Air town? Because they should really be preventing people like me from raising this child. And then the aliens come back for her. Can I comment about her clothes? I don't know if that's common for there not to be a button where the boobs are. I just... I don't mean to be staring at an animated character's boobs, but there should be a button there, right? My my OCD is telling me that that's wrong. <laughs> you got ten years, kid, and I'm kicking you out. You know, she could just still live with me. I'm not a monster. <laughs> maybe, maybe I am a monster. You didn't go outside, you dumb fart. Oh, I could have named her shit. That would have been, would have been even funnier. Shit pants. We outside, you shit. She's such a little shit. Oh, well, I'll, I'll stick with fart. I'm such a child. All right. So, uh, you into like sports? <laughs> Do they teach you that at the alien school? Hey, you're the game. Don't ask me. Where's that fart asking me? If fart starts asking me, where do we keep the uh, the records of our uh, vehicle structural anomalies, then I'm going to know that she's a plant. She's a sleeper fart. Silent but deadly. Is this this has to be? I hope this is the same day because if she wears the same clothes every day, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> Hi. Uh, yeah. Is it about our alien overlords? No, no. If they have a pamphlet for what to do with your new child, then clearly they have CPS, and if they have CPS, uh, they should not be giving me a child. This girl isn't a teenager. She's a tween at best. <laughs> Doesn't look anything to you. <laughs> Am I in Westworld? <laughs> oh, that's crazy. <laughs> oh no that's not what I was trying to do that's creepy how do I get out of that then nope nope <laughs> how do I get out of that <laughs> take that stupid ribbon off that was okay I feel really bad about that that was not my intent None. You. Oh, 
I have to give her money? Okay. I'm gonna raise her like I wish I was raised. I don't know what this is. Don't care. I don't care about your stupid mail. Okay. Okay. So... <laughs> Spoil? Can she have a job? Lavish meal plan. We'll do art class because I'm a good person. More art. We don't want a fat child. I'm feeding her a lot, so we'll give her some gymnastics. And then we'll do more art because, you know what? Fuck public um, school. And uh, we'll do some more arithmetic. Is that all I do? Nope, you're not gonna meet any friends. What does that logo mean? These calendar dates are just... Like, do we decide that we're going to do the calendar anymore? What is going on? <laughs> Horrible. <laughs> he ain't gonna. No, she's an alien, you dumbass! Wait, what? Don't worry, she's an alien pretending to be a refugee. Maybe she was a refugee, she doesn't remember any of it. All her family and friends are dead. Because you're an alien! Fart, don't tell people these things. They're going to figure it out. I mean, I did. Tell them your your last name. No, you're not. You're a child. Shut up. Good luck. <laughs> I mean, soccer is a game no one plays. That's in, at least in the American shuttle station. That's why it's so unknown. Yeah. Arc 5 was America's arc. <laughs> Soccer? Do you mean football? Who's raincoat lady? Fart, I've taught you not to be scared of meek things like jump scares. It's Becky. Fuck you, Becky. That's right, teacher doesn't like slackers. I'm raising you to be a strong, smart girl fart. Don't fall for this bullshit peer pressure.
No, it's going to be horrible. Don't get your hopes up. Oh, this stupid girl. <laughs> Mondays, am I right? That lady is back? You got it right and then you fell asleep. I... <laughs> Take that art. <laughs> She's an alien. Leave her alone. Oh. better land properly next time your alien overlords will be angry at you why is she not gaining bath stamina when she sleeps oh it's the lady that saved her Hate Marco. Oof. Inside the child menu. I don't like you knowing this stuff.
So how does she get more stamina? Alright, so 52 weeks a year, so 520 rounds of the game? Why am I doing my kids' homework, apparently? That's an alien, right? She's an alien. Why does this game keep ignoring the fact that people are aliens? Something went wrong there. Is this Child Protective Services? You just walk right into my house. <laughs> Child Protective Services. Are we treating children like Pokemon? This is terrifying. <gasps> I did not read that text on the flip flop before. Oh no. That is terrifying. Oh. <laughs> and naming her fart wasn't enough? So they can take you away from me and then send me to jail. I'm just not going to let you in the house next time, lady. You little brat! Where's the chocolate? I think I think this is a good place. Let's save this in slot one. 
I'm going to tell you right now, I think this game is hilarious. Um, I'm going to play it more. I'm probably going to come back and do another video. Uh, yeah, 14 minutes of playtime, 15 minutes of watching that freaking intro video. Ugh. Um, but yeah, no, um, I'm going to come back and play this game a little bit more. It's got a little age track, height tracker. That's hilarious. All right. Well, I think this this is a pretty fun game. I definitely recommend trying it out, and I'm definitely going to come back to this. We're going to revisit this again soon. Thank you guys so much. See you next time.